Have you ever wondered how computers work? How these machines, whether simple or complex, have become such an integral part of our lives? Well, sit back and enjoy the ride as we delve into the fascinating world of computers and their evolution. In the beginning, computers were not the sleek, multifunctional devices we know today. They were created with a singular purpose, to perform calculations. Think of the abacus, that simple yet effective tool used for calculations since ancient times. As the Industrial Revolution took hold, the need for automation became apparent. Mechanical devices were developed to perform long, tedious tasks, such as guiding patterns for looms. Fast forward to the early 20th century, and we see the emergence of more sophisticated electrical machines designed to carry out specialized analog calculations. World War II saw the birth of the first digital electronic calculating machines. These were groundbreaking, both in their use of electromechanical technology and thermionic valves. But the real game-changer came in the late 1940s with the advent of the first semiconductor transistors. These transistors paved the way for the silicon-based MOSFET and monolithic integrated circuit chip technologies of the late 1950s. This was the starting point of the microprocessor and microcomputer revolution of the 1970s, a period that witnessed an exponential increase in the speed, power, and versatility of computers. The trend of rapid growth in transistor counts, as noted in Moore's Law, which posits that counts double every two years, has led to the digital revolution, spanning the late 20th to the early 21st centuries. A modern computer, in its most basic form, consists of at least one processing element, usually a central processing unit, or CPU, in the form of a microprocessor, along with some type of computer memory, typically semiconductor memory chips. The processing element executes arithmetic and logical operations, and a sequencing and control unit can alter the order of operations based on stored information. Also crucial are peripheral devices, which include input devices like keyboards and mice, output devices like monitor screens and printers, and input-output devices that perform both functions, such as the touchscreen technology we've become so accustomed to in the 21st century. These devices enable information retrieval from external sources and allow the results of operations to be saved and retrieved. Output? So, there you have it. From the humble beginnings of simple calculating machines to the high-powered, multifaceted devices of today, the evolution of computers is a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of progress. Computers in their various forms have integrated themselves into every facet of our lives, from our homes to our workplaces, from our pockets to the vast expanses of the internet that connects billions of users worldwide. And still, the journey continues, promising ever more astounding developments in the future. As we look back on the path that has led us here, it's safe to say that the world of computers is as fascinating as it is complex and as essential as it is ever-evolving.